Good day everyone. It is nice to see you again. Welcome to our any learning as our learning community. Lesson 1. Shock. Clinical manifestations of the types of shock. Table 2 summarizes at clinical presentations of the types of shock and diagnostic findings, specifically in cardiovascular system, pulmonary system, renal system, skin, neurologic system, and gastrointestinal system. Under cardiogenic shock, signs and symptoms in cardiovascular system are as follows, tachycardia, hypertension, decreased in capillary refill, and chest pain, but may or may not be present. Pulmonary system, tachypnea, crackles, cyanosis, and ronchi. Renal system, increased in sodium and water retention, decreased renal blood flow, and decreased urine output. Skin may pallor, cool and clammy. Neurologic system, decreased cerebral perfusion, that may lead to anxiety, confusion, and agitation and under gastrointestinal system, there is decreased bowel sounds, nausea and vomiting. Diagnostic findings in cardiogenic shock are as follows, increased cardiac markers, increased in brain type natriuretic peptide, increased blood glucose, increased blood urea nitrogen. In ECG, there is dysrhythmias. Echocardiogram shows, for instance, left ventricular dysfunction. And lastly chest x-ray, for instance, pulmonary infiltrate. Next is hypovolemic shock. Signs and symptoms are as follows. In cardiovascular system, decreased preload, decreased stroke volume, and decreased capillary refill. Pulmonary system, tachypnea that may lead to bradypnea as late sign. Renal system, decreased urine output, skin, maybe pallor cool and clammy neurologic system decreased cerebral perfusion that may lead to anxiety confusion and agitation and in gastrointestinal system there is an absent bowel sounds diagnostic findings in hypovolemic shock are as follows decreased hematocrit decreased hemoglobin increased lactate increased urine specific gravity and lastly, changes in electrolytes. Signs and symptoms under neurogenic shock are as follows. Cardiovascular system. Decreased blood pressure. Either increased or decreased in temperature. And bradycardia. Pulmonary system. There is dysfunction related to level of injury. Renal system. Bladder dysfunction. Skin. Decreased skin perfusion. Cool or warm. And dry skin. Neurologic system, flaccid paralysis below the level of the lesion, and loss of reflex activity, and lastly, gastrointestinal system, bowel dysfunction. Signs and symptoms under anaphylactic shock are as follows. Cardiovascular system, chest pain and third spacing of fluid, pulmonary system, dysfunction related to level of injury, renal system, incontinence, skin. Flushing, pruritus, urticaria, and angioedema, neurologic system, anxiety, feeling of impending doom, confusion, decreased in level of consciousness, and metallic taste, and lastly, gastrointestinal system, cramping, abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea. Diagnostic findings in anaphylactic shock are as follows. This is sudden in onset. Ask for history of allergies and exposure to contrast media. Signs and symptoms under septic shock are as follows. Cardiovascular system. Increased or decreased in temperature. Myocardial dysfunction. Ventricular dilation. And decreased ejection fraction. Pulmonary system. Hyperventilation crackles, respiratory alkalosis that may lead to respiratory acidosis, hypoxemia, respiratory failure, acute respiratory distress syndrome, and pulmonary hypertension. 
renal system, decreased urine output, skin, warm and flush that may lead to cool and mottled skin as late sign. Neurologic system, alteration in mental status, for instance, confusion, agitation, and coma as late sign and gastrointestinal system there is gastrointestinal bleeding and paralytic ileus diagnostic findings in septic shock are as follows increased or decreased in white blood cells decreased platelets increased lactate increased blood glucose increased urine specific gravity decreased urine sodium and positive blood cultures Signs and symptoms under obstructive shock are as follows. Cardiovascular system. Decreased blood pressure. And decreased preload. Pulmonary system. Tachypnea that may lead to bradypnea as late sign. And shortness of breath. Renal system. Decreased urine output. Skin. Pallor. Cool. And clammy. Neurologic system. Decreased cerebral perfusion. That may lead to anxiety confusion and agitation and gastrointestinal system decreased to absent bowel sounds diagnostic findings in obstructive shock is specific to cause of obstruction kindly click the next button for part 3 thank you for listening have a good day and be safe agyamanak